is that see it's okay it's probably just makeup <laughs> so i'm about to watch joker on my ones on my jack jones why 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 shannon why reason why is because do you know what i love doing shit by myself if you have me on instagram and snapchat and things like that you will know that i am such an independent person and yesterday i thought i really want to watch a joker because of the reviews i've heard and you know people just like n walking out like walking out of the cinema because it's so deep um so i was like let's watch that deep film so i can't wait i will absolutely give my honest opinion after after it's done I am so excited. So I've been sitting on an idea, a goal rather, for a while. Now I've recently switched gyms where I'm training. There was an incident the other week, I'm just going to say it for the last time. <laughs> there was an incident and I needed a spot for my 25kg press and the guy that I asked outright refused to spot me. I was very unhappy but I was like no do you know what I wish you healing because you need it clearly <laughs> um so that is that I moved to the gym joint in Bourne End I know a couple of people that go there and have said about going there but the kind of thing that put me off was the price um, but they had a little deal going on and I thought I'll just grab the deal might as well that was like a sign to be like let's go so I changed I've been there for about a week now I do really like it oh wow i do like it i'm usually a morning trainer um and then since being there i've done one morning session and i did, wasn't like keen not not like because of the gym or anything just because of the way it's a little bit further to travel um so i have been doing my sessions in the evening which wasn't really fond of at the start but getting used to it it's actually not too bad because it's not that busy there it is pretty it is really really decent like it's the equipment is so good as well but this video is kind of like explaining well i'm three minutes into it now so i would have to probably cut things out but long story short my goal is finally a fitness competition that is just out there right now i'm putting it into the universe the universe is gonna bring me back what i want since i've moved james i've had quite a couple of people that be like oh like you're in really great shape are you doing a competition etc and i've always been like no like competitions aren't my thing like I, i'm not doing a competition um and it's actually made me think and i'm like do you know what why why like, why am i not doing a competition i in my head i thought if I do a competition, my training will become a chore, my diet will become, you know, like, I just feel like it would all become an effort. And at the minute I enjoy doing, I enjoy training um, and the cut that I'm on, I'm really enjoying it. But I feel like subconsciously a competition has been in the back of my mind. I'm now 24, like just turned 24. I say just turned like July, that's not really just turned. And I thought it's a little, it's about time. I want to try and step on stage around April, May time before like the summer holidays because I do want to go like to a festival in, in June and stuff. It's yeah, it's subconsciously like put me in a state of right, this is like prep for competition. So I will go on a bulk eventually over winter period and then I'll probably cut again in like February time. I don't know what the what it's like, what the actual prep time is like. It's, a lot of people say it's about 12 weeks. I don't know. I just want to get like that good foundation and I feel like this is exactly what Ryan is helping me with and... Ryan's never done a, a comp, a bikini prep. Is that right? Yeah, he's never done, done like a plan for it. So I'll be like almost his first one and he's reading a lot into it. I'm obviously like researching into it as well. And last night at Starbucks, I was literally just looking at like people's videos, people's experiences. It is expensive, it is, isn't cheap. Um, things like the coach, the posing, the bikini, the tan, the shoes, hair, makeup, like everything. Luckily I've actually got a friend who can do my makeup for me. So little things like that is like kind of in the future but it will come around really 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 quick and i'm so excited because it's giving me like a breath of fresh air and a new goal and i just feel like i need something now to really focus on apart from like work and just general gym i just want to take it that next step and i feel like i'm now ready to do it so oh yes i'm so excited um i will keep you guys updated i will tell you more about my cut i am now obviously gonna go to starbucks and then watch the films i will tell you guys how i found the film so keep watching and i'll be back because this isn't weird at all going by yourself oh. i'm done done this mirror at the gym 
that I'm at. Okay, obviously I can't see abs, but kind of, there's like a line. Can you see it? No, because you can't. Why, why, why? Okay, I'm gonna try again. I don't know if this is gonna work. Please stay where you are. Okay, so I have just finished pull and cardio. Well, I say cardio, I literally did like 10 minutes, but I'm gonna come back later and do cardio. So, this is my new gym. Let me just show you the outside and then I'll show you the inside possibly later. So, it's this one here. Yeah, it's not bad, it's decent. Okay, um, so what did I think of the Joker? This is my honest opinion. Um, what did I think? Uh, I get it. Like, I get why he was like, mm. I say I get why he was like he was. I mean, like, trauma is a huge thing. Like, people either heal from trauma or you go like fucking crazy like he did um and he obviously went crazy now i just want to say that everybody has the opportunity to change their life um unfortunately he was like so stuck in a mindset of you know wanting attention and unfortunately nowadays it's almost like attention in today's society is like the new currency and people always want attention and if they don't get it like a, a very sort of narcissistic um trait I would say and a lot of people nowadays aren't are very narcissistic I see it a lot in people and it is very like me 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 I want attention if I don't get attention I get ignored I I will react and like he obviously reacted in you know violence he just wanted that attention that love um it, it was sad like I you know yeah it was sad but I thought it was good <laughs> I thought it was good I'm glad I went to watch it I, yeah, a lot of mixed reviews about it, but I, I, I enjoyed it. Yeah, I enjoyed it. So I have now done my pull workout. I am gonna head home. I'm gonna have my post workout, and then I'm gonna come back later and do some cardi. Oh, we all love cardio. We really, really don't. But now I've got this goal in my mind. I'm so glad that you guys know as well. <laughs> um, it kind of gives me like a little focus. So, um, yeah, it's all good. All good in the. What is with my earphones? Why does it do this? It's like the weight of the earphone. Ugh, I'm struggling myself. Yeah, I have a real issue with like staying at home doing nothing. Like I just get so bored and distracted. So I'm shockingly off to Starbucks again. They've closed at seven tonight. Oh, I, I needed to add something about the Joker as well. The importance of being nice. It is so simple, but like he was bullied and he was, you know, like traumatized. You, do, you don't know what someone is going through in life and yeah, it is the importance, even like what I'm doing personally for like my own self, like worth and self-improvement and self-love. I make a conscious effort of just being nice to people, like even when I'm, it sounds so silly, but even when I'm driving along and I get like pissed off at someone or something, I now, like instead of trying to shout and rave and be like, oh no, you dickhead, blah, 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 I'm like, wait, no, stop wish him wish him love wish him love because you can only give what you have so if you're hurt you're gonna hurt people which is what the joker did but as i said you can change it you can flip it you are in control of your mind you are in control of your your life you are in control of your world you are in control of the outcome um so i think that's really important yeah just to be nice to everybody because nowadays the world isn't you know the nicest of places and we need people that are nice and that do change it and do change things like that so yeah that's enough rambling for me i'm gonna head off to starbucks get my coffee get a little treat or something um and then cardio cardio it is on a sunday evening hallelujah so i've just finished starbucks and you know what like i am so focused on this new goal of mine like the whole time i was in there i was looking at figure versus bikini um and i'm still kind of looking at the differences between them um i have asked someone that i know has done competitions and she's actually asked me like 
send me some pictures of yourself so I did I've sent her some pictures so I'm waiting for her to like respond but I think the best thing is to get advice from someone who's actually done it and been there and knows what it's like as well I'm very torn between what I want to go into as in terms of bikini or figure I feel like for figure I do have that vitae part and like the back and the quads I it's like that x shape I feel like I have got that already so it kind of puts me in that little bit of you know puts me ahead um in that category but I'm very small, like, even though I have that shape, I, I feel like I could, I could do the bikini, but it's kind of putting me off the whole discipline, but I know that either category I go into, it's going to be discipline, but even now, like, I'm going to do cardio at the gym, and I just feel like, I just feel like I'm set, and I'm ready, and I'm so focused on this, and I, I'm actually getting so excited already about it, I I've lost count how many times I've said the word excited in this video, but I just am like even now going to the gym Maybe in like a couple of months time. I won't be the same. I'll probably be like, oh, I've got to gym But at the minute I'm like I can't wait to go to the gym because I feel like I lost a little bit of motivation at the gym recently I don't know why but I feel like now I've got this goal I am really starting to get back on track and it's giving me something to work towards and I know that I can do it This is the thing like I know even just imagining myself like on stage I've always been a performer anyway. People know who I am. I'm a singer. I'm, so I, you know I love being in front of people and I love that attention and you know on stage you do get that level of attention and it's you um, and I feel like it's just perfect it would just be perfect for me I'm really fucking excited let me stop talking but yeah I uh, I'm very undecided what I want to go in I'm gonna wait for some advice I am now going off to do cardio I think I'm gonna do 20 minutes on cross and then 20 minutes on bike we'll see how it goes but I really do need to up my cardio now so I have my post back up meal which is Cocoa Pops, what else is it? yogurt, protein powder, st frozen strawberries, frozen blueberries. But I made this at like 10 o'clock this morning and it's pretty, you know, like not fresh, but it's still nice, I don't really care. So I did, in the end, 20 minutes hit on the cross trainer and I did 10 minutes incline walk at like 14% speed three and a half miles per hour which wasn't too bad um I am now editing this video that you're watching from the whole day and I've decided to do fasted cardio tomorrow morning so I've got my alarm set for half six which is I don't know how to feel about that so this is going to be like it's check-in day tomorrow as well so I'll tell you guys what my check-in is and what my progress is like and stuff so that'll be a good little video to add on after this one so I'm gonna leave this one here um, and if you have any questions let me know drop me a message follow my social media and I will yes I will see you in the next video so see you soon bye